It's been one year since this sinkhole swallowed a home in Apopka. The walls crumbling, the floor falling. The family forced out and told to watch as it grew to nearly 30 feet. All new at 11, New 6's Jennifer Ortega returned to that home tonight to see what's happened over the past 12 months. Right here where I'm standing is where a sinkhole opened up one year ago from yesterday. The family says they've demolished the house and since then they've already started to rebuild. If you can keep your family together, you can make a home out of anywhere. That's Gary Miller's positive outlook. After a sinkhole 25 feet wide and growing opened up near his house on West Kelly Park Road. Yeah. We were there a year ago as the growing hole swallowed at least half of the family's home. Miller says it was the house they had lived in since 1969. That the damage was so bad, workers told him they would need to start completely over. We sat here and watched the whole thing go down. We, uh, we watched them tear it down and we watched them haul it off and we watched them fill up the hole. And now, 12 months later, what used to be a gaping hole is now just a lot of sand. It's not what we wanted to do, but we're making do with what we got and moving on. Miller shows us around his new construction, telling us he pushed it back on his property just far enough away from where the sinkhole once was. I said there's sinkholes all over the state of Florida. Mm -hmm. Nothing tells me that there's going to be another one underneath here. Miller says a sinkhole isn't going to stop his family from starting over. It was just my, my lucky day. I'd rather hit the lottery, but I got uh, a sinkhole instead. And the homeowner says his new house should be ready just in time for the holidays. In Apopka, Jennifer Ortega, New 6.